Dun, 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 dun. The answer here, the correct answer is going to be do, 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 B. It's going to okay. be B. I found this on the web for here. Okay, shut up. So with that, there it is. The answer is B on that one, my part of people. So with that said, here um, we're talking about production here. So the number of items that we have is going up if we're producing items right here. Producing items. Um, so with that said, what we're looking for here is X. We're looking for X hours. And what we're going to have is the inventory goal of 9,700. So the goal of 9,700 was reached. So that means that Y equals 9,700. And it's going to be reached in X hours. Again, that's how you can connect those two things. Evan, I'm glad this setup is getting easier because tomorrow we haven't even gone through all the problem types that we have here, man. I have 10 different problem types and there are 50 total problem variations in terms of, hey, are you solving for M, X, B, Y? Then here are all these situations. Like I, I, I literally rotate all of it in there. And tomorrow is going to be the end-all, be-all for solving equations work problems. So if you are, if you can come tomorrow, come tomorrow, man. Um, so here, the rate that we have is going to be 180 glasses per hour. And that's positive because we're producing. It's going up. And then we had the 160 units already there. So boom. Once you have that, all you got to do is set up, solve, and you're done. So let me go ahead and just set up the, uh, the problem right here. It'll be 9,700 equals, then it'll be 180 times X plus 160. And then all you have to do is solve that and you will get B. So with that said, before y'all head out, because we still got three minutes and I want to make sure that y'all stay excited for this and stay hungry because it's not just about being jacked up and excited about being in this class today. It's about making sure that you're doing what you can to keep that progress and that momentum going forward. So quick question, my party people. Um, yeah, Evan, if you're in the program, you get all the recordings, so you're good. Um, so with that said, my math party people, I got a quick question for y'all. Who here wants to see the casual practice um, shown in the arithmetic reasoning math bootcamp? Who wants to see it? Yeah, you know you want to. So let me actually go ahead and just finish this little setting change right here. And boom, I'm going to go ahead and show y'all what I just did here uh, for all of this. So let me go ahead and save this and switch my screen over so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. So boom, saved. And we are good. Sweet. So with that, awesome. And there we go. So let me switch over my screen because I was just actually building it out for you while you guys are doing the problems. So here's how you get there. If you look over here on the left side, you see that we're under section six, solving equations, word problems. And you're going to have actually all of these lessons already there for you. So that's eight total lessons. But here's where you're going to see all the casual practice. So you're going to see under section six in the arithmetic reasoning boot camp, booyah, right there. And look at how awesome this is. You can pick whichever one, identifying M, and B, um, solving for Y, solving for X, solving for M, solving for B, it's all there. So let's go and say we wanna solve for X. You click that and you hit that and look at that. Look at what happens, pay attention. Look at how awesome this is. I'm gonna go ahead and just go casual and I'm gonna say, okay, I'm looking at this problem and I think the answer is gonna be 29 minutes. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna click this button right here. It's gonna say submit. You click that submit button and guess what my party people? Boom, okay, apparently I got lucky, I got it right. But let's say I didn't get it right. Well, guess what? I automatically programmed the solutions to every single problem. Don't believe me? Bet. So you're gonna go ahead and go to the next question. I'll click 34 minutes, bam. Again, I got it wrong here, oh no. The answer was 35 minutes, but here's exactly how you do it. With the, same, with the numbers from that specific problem automatically coded in step by step every single time all the way through and you now have 400 questions to work with right now um it's going to be five questions at a time and and when you're done what you're going to do is hit try again brand new questions try again brand new questions try again brand new questions and before you go if you like what you saw and you want to raise your score with thousands of practice problems just like that so you can lower that test anxiety raise that confidence 
go to this link right here to check out the full program. There's a video that shows you exactly how it works, but you're gonna get lessons, guided practice, worksheets, speed drills, and everything that you need to feel supported from day one all the way until you pass. Again, I'm Coach Anderson, and I'll see you soon.